Hi, I'm Brittany Saturn. And I'm Brian Belcher. And, and welcome, welcome to, to Forest, Forest Life. Life. Who the fuck put these dandelions in front of my house? I don't know. It's probably the same fuck that put that stupid turnip next to your house. Well, I did that. Hmm. Uh, well, today's a, a very special day. <laughs> God damn it. God. I was like... Do you have? I was like, did you have a, like a weird wisp thing happen? And then, oh god! No, I just made a wonderful pun that's not even that good or original. Uh, today, it's not is even anything to do with today because we're fishing. Bears catch fish, Brian. Are you going to eat some salmon? Yes. Is a salmon run? Yes. It's a wrong Nintendo yes. game. Yes. It's fall though. There is salmon in the rivers. Okay. Salmon in the rivers. Okay. Or so, the waterfalls, right? Uh, yes. Yeah, I think so. All right, we'll go to the town hall. We gotta see what um, we're doing. Okay. Yeah. So we gotta go to the event plaza and find out more information about the fishing tournament. Oh my god. Everybody, everybody's got fishing rods I fucking today. I hate Ricky so much. Brian loves him. Though, uh, why so. do you hate Ricky? He's ugly. He's he's not nearly as ugly as Marcel. And they're both equally ugly. They're not equally they ugly. They are. One is a fucking uh, clown. All right. The other one's just a hyper-colored squirrel. Here's Chip, the beaver. Hey, Chip. Crucian oh, cart. we gotta find a crucian cart. Well, okay. at least that's, like, a pretty normal catch. Yeah, so we have until 6 p.m. and it's 5.30 right now, so... Alright, here we go. Good luck to us. Let's see what's in my pockets. I don't even know what's in here right now. Not much. Dandelion. Okay. Alright, cool. We can just jump right in then. Alright, guys. Welcome to the fishing tournament. We're going to get the biggest cruising carp you have ever Damn fucking much. seen. Not Let's that see. one. <laughs> so... Not oh, that one. Get that mushroom. Yeah, get that mushroom. Also, um, you do know that running is going to scare fish away, right? Or I'm not running. Hard? Walking hard does it too. No, it doesn't. It does? No, it doesn't. It doesn't scare them away, but it makes the big ones go uh, harder to get catch. I don't think that's true at all. Okay. Shh, be fair. <laughs> This is going to be Brittany's a quiet gonna, episode. Everyone's going to be like... Brittany's going to throw the fishing uh, bobber onto the other side of the fish. Damn it. What the fuck was that, Brittany? That wasn't a cruciate carp anyway. It wasn't the right size, so don't worry about it, Brian. Don't worry. Okay. That I was just a tester. That was okay. Cool. <laughs> that was a good start. More mushrooms. <laughs> More mushrooms. So... There's like you know, no carp. No carp in the river at all. <laughs> well, I mean, we did come at the end of the day. Um, so you have been, uh, you're usually okay at fishing. What happened? <laughs> hey, I messed up one time. You've been messing up a lot. Well, I think hey. part of that is because I've been looking at the... How many damn mush wall lamps are you going I don't know. Get? We're selling that bitch. I guess I'll go ahead and dig up whatever's in here, too. Yeah, yeah. Um... No, my problem is that I've been looking at the monitor instead of the actual 3DS. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I think there is a slight lag, which doesn't matter for anything else, but it matters for fishing, obviously. Oh, that's a big one. Also, I, I keep forgetting the buttons. So, what is it, B? No, it's A. It's A. Yeah. And then okay, again. we just had to do a test because cool. I've been playing Mario Odyssey and I. Yeah, and the buttons all the are all buttons backwards. Are different. Yeah, yeah. Going from the 3DS to the Switch, the Switch to anything else is annoying. Yeah, to be I honest. just can't do it. I think we talked about this in an earlier episode about how it uses the Japanese uh, controls. Yeah, and it just fucks with me, so I have to think about it. Oh, that's a damn bass. Black bass. I don't think you have that one, so you no, need to I donate it. I do need it, but I still don't fucking care about it. All right. Brittany Still don't give don't no fucks. Don't fucking care about it. It's be the shit fish. A shit fish? <laughs> shit fish. What the fuck are you saying over there? <laughs> I'm sorry I messed up. My words, they don't work. <laughs> <laughs> My word box broke today. You know, normally in real life, you can make a bub like that and it doesn't matter. Yeah. But when you are recording an internet video, <laughs> internet people video. will notice and let you know that you say words well that's what badly. i'm here for so i can go ahead and be the terrible comment system <laughs> that way it's right up in your face and you can punch me if uh if you need to don't worry i definitely will <laughs> <laughs> ooh, 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 ooh. there we go i really seize the tm okay, but that's so a regular this... carp isn't it's not a crucian carp was it not a crucian carp just a carp no oh, what the what the hell what the hell? Is this the only river we have? This is the only river we have. Yeah. Huh. 
A river runs through it. You know, I just... No, not that's not the one I watched the other day. I watched um, The Legend of the Fall, which oh, is yeah. very similar, I think. At least the cover looks I similar. I have absolutely <laughs> never watched a, a River Runs Through. Well, so it, they no both idea. star Brad Pitt. Okay, so that's... And they both came out, like, back to back, I think. So, like, my, my, they, fa- my favorite movie comparison is Fight Club and Seven Years in Tibet. You know why? Because Brad Pitt's in both of them. <laughs> Well, Brad Pitt is in both Legends of the Fall and um, A River Runs Through It. Yeah, yeah. I've never watched either of those movies, I don't think. Legends yeah. of the Fall? What's, uh... Legends of the Fall was on Amazon Prime. I've okay, been like, so... going through Amazon Prime watching all the like weird so movies on there. We've had Amazon Prime for like three years now, but and I... Brittany just realized I that forgot. there's a video program. Yeah, so I'm like watching all the, the stuff on there. It is a really good movie, but it's like two hours long. Barbell Steve. I don't need you. Yeah, you can get rid a of barrel that. roll is what we call that fish. <laughs> barrel roll. Out here in Mosswood, we call that a barrel roll. Um, no, it's a really good movie. It's like two hours long. It won and some Oscars, so you know that everyone dies in it. <laughs> Just gonna let you know right out front. It's about these three brothers living in Montana during the 1920s or some shit. Nice, got a mitten crab. A mitten crab. I didn't know so you could we, catch those with a fishing pole. I don't think I've ever caught a mitten crab before. So someone in uh, in our uh, episode two comments told us that we could catch those in the river. Hey, guess what? If you're still watching, we did. Thank you for that hot tip. I didn't tell her at all. It just <laughs> happened. That's okay. I can feel your comment in my soul, exactly. as you can all YouTube comments. Um, their name was just Japanese characters, so thank you, Japanese characters. Great, love it. I think everyone caught all crucian carps. Watch us not even have a fish to enter. That in would be tournament. hilarious. Our first we spent tournament. an entire episode <laughs> on a fishing tournament. Oh wait, okay, so something came back over here. Well, while I am fishing for this, why don't you tell us... Oh, uh, you want me to go tell to us National a little, Day? Tell us a little ditty about National Day. I'm eager to hear what today is. Oh, man, that's a big I'm old... I'm catching everything except for what I need to catch. <laughs> <laughs> I guess you need to go donate some stuff yeah. so you have room in your pockets. One more. Well, guys, while we are watching her catch some fish, today is uh, National Day. National Day is where we celebrate the whatever is being celebrated that day. <laughs> I was uh, like, curious where you're going with that. I don't know. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I, was, I forgot my entire routine, Brittany. Yeah. So, it has been a couple of days. So, um, so National Day, there's always something, na- National Something Day, and today is no exception. We're, uh, today is National Adoption Day. Oh, okay. Get so, out there and adopt. Does that specify humans or animals? Uh, actually, it doesn't. But I, uh, I assume humans, because <laughs> uh, the picture had a bunch of uh, human babies. Human babies. Human babies. Human go, children. Go get you a human baby. <laughs> go get you a real human child, if you so please. Uh, but I, I think I can also extend that out to if you want to adopt an animal, you should adopt an animal too. So there's actually a program that you like to where you can uh, buy animals for people. Um, I forget what it's called, but you're it's a big the fan of it. Heifer organization. Okay. And basically, what they do is um, it's for underdeveloped countries okay you can buy either a whole animal or a share of an animal Mm -hmm. and it's animals that can give back basically like cows you know you can use their milk sheep you can use their wool yeah uh ducks chickens bees there's all kinds of animals that people can use in communities and basically they um will get a pair of animals a breeding pair so that they can uh you know, kind of share it with the community. Yeah. Uh, and I think it's a really cool way of f- actually f- uh, finding a solution to a problem. Yeah. A lot of times with uh, underdeveloped countries, uh, a lot of organizations just like to dump money into their uh, problems. Yeah, yeah. But sometimes money doesn't, it's not a, it's not a permanent solution. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. And this is like a really cool way to like actually fix a problem yeah yeah and they also give these people classes and show them how to take care of the animals properly and a lot of people are able to go to school and further education and actually feed their families through this organization so so it's the whole teach a man to fish thing yeah pretty much uh, let's swap out you yeah, got some i've got something in here i can get rid of i think i uh, get rid of the dandelion <laughs> yeah there you go bam well let's go ahead and donate and... yeah i need to go donate 
Uh, speaking of other things, to, uh, adoption, uh, we actually know quite a few people who are A, either adopted, or B, uh, are adopting. Yeah. So, um, in one way or another. It's a hard process. It, it really I didn't realize is. how difficult it was to adopt a child in the and United expensive. States. And expensive. And very expensive. It's so weird to me because, like, there's so many children who need homes. Why are we making this so hard, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but I don't know. There is also, uh, but we also have another day to celebrate. We got today. really serious for a minute there. We did, we did there. <laughs> well, uh, I guess, like, adoption is pretty... It's a serious uh, it's subject. It's a pretty serious subject, so... But um, that's not the only thing we're celebrating today. Uh, today is also National Princess Day. Oh. Which, uh, for all the ladies and, fuck it, other dudes out there who want to be a princess today... <laughs> Go be a princess. I was going to ask you, Brian, are you a princess? Sometimes. Are you a pretty, pretty princess? Some days. Some No, seriously, like, some days I just want to just, like, get a pedicure or some shit, you know? <laughs> I mean, it feels good. Uh, you know. Sometimes you just want to put on It's a... been, like, a couple of years, but... <laughs> <laughs> well, today you should go get a pedicure. Oh, man. Be that, a, that sounds fantastic. A motherfucking princess. But, um, celebrate. It's, it's, uh, supposedly to make little girls feel special. Yeah. Um, but I, I'm going to celebrate it by saying, you know what? Go feel special. You're special. You know it. And you should go celebrate yourself. You know? Heck yeah. Who's your favorite princess, Brian? Uh, are we doing Disney or in general? Or any princess you any want princess? to tell me. Because everyone always is like Disney princesses, so I was curious. Oh, well, I was thinking real princesses, but you can also do fictional Princess Diana, I guess? Princess. I don't know. <laughs> That's the only one I think anybody knows. Uh, I, if you know of another real princess that you like besides right? Princess Diana, please let us know because... That's all us dumb Americans know over here. We don't here. have monarchies <laughs> like the rest of y'all. No, <laughs> we don't really. I don't follow. A lot of people follow the royal family, but I do not. I'm not one I of don't. Um, so I know the uh, the current princess who just had like a couple that. babies. Kate? Is that her name? Yeah, Princess Kate. That's, That's only it. because you read the magazines while we check out. Exactly. <laughs> they're, always, they're always. I'm like, oh, yeah, look. <laughs> she looks like a normal fucking person. You yep. Uh, that's one thing I will say is Princess Diana did not, uh, I, and this is not a knock on her. She didn't look like a normal person. She looked like royalty. She just had that regal, regal look, you right. know. And that's funny because she was actually a commoner. Exactly. She married into the royal. Well, family. they needed to get that fucking like spread the blood out a little bit. <laughs> have you the, have you seen Prince Charles? He's he. he Shovel face. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so. What time is it? But yeah, so. We got 15 minutes, y'all. <laughs> so I've that not was. not caught a single <clears throat> Christian carp. That was National Day. Um, make sure to go celebrate those days. Um, tweet us out how you are celebrating those. And make sure to, you know, put hashtag uh, National Adoption Day or National Princess Day at us. That way, you know, we can celebrate the uncelebrated. That sounds really... Well, they're really not. That's the whole purpose of National Days, I've noticed, is that it's, it's usually just like, hey, look at this thing that no one talks about or does anything about, you know? Yeah. Go celebrate it. And that's cool. Yeah, I, I think that. it's like some of it's serious and some of it is silly. Oh, yeah. I mean, the princess thing's kind of silly, but you can make it not silly. A cherry salmon. Man, we're, we're, gonna well, be, we're getting the... I'm getting plenty of fish in the museum, but we are failing at this fishing tournament. Hey, at least we're getting something. Hey, it's better than nothing, I guess. Yep. Nothing, nothing means nothing. Well, while you're continuing to fish, I but guess I'll go But you gotta have something. I don't know the next line, so I can't. I can't. Nobody knows the next line. I don't even think I'm saying that line right. I was on my way to work the other day. Yeah, and it was on. And it was on, and I was like, yeah. It's like nothing, nothing means nothing. <laughs> that's exactly. But you gotta have something. That's exactly. If you wanna get with me. Yeah, it's something like that. When I was like driving on the desolate highway at 3 a.m. Mm-hmm. Because I work third shift. I don't know if I've mentioned that on here before. So yeah, guys. I work uh, third shift. Brittany works third shift. Uh, and while she's working, that's when I edit these. 
<laughs> we are zombie people. Uh, so come on. Cart. Which is weird because it's like 4 p.m., which is pretty early for us. Um, it is 5:45, you, Brian. You're right. What are you even doing? You cannot tell. Ty. I'm time traveling. You know we sprang backwards. <laughs> we <laughs> fell backwards. <laughs> I fell backwards and uh, time caught me. Uh, I fell backwards. Well, while we're while you're fishing around over there, why don't we go ahead and celebrate everybody's birthdays today? <gasps> everybody's birthdays, my so, favorite part. If it is your birthday, happy birthday! Happy birthday! November eighteenth birthdays. Happy birthday to you! And thank you for joining us yep. on your birthday. Uh, I hope we're, you are enjoying your Saturday birthday. Sorry you didn't get the free day off, or uh, I don't know. Maybe you did. Maybe you took <laughs> Friday off. Maybe you actually just you know. Got that free three-day weekend. I don't know. I know somebody who... Oh, snap. Got a koi. <sighs> you koi are getting everything but don't what you need. Don't koi with me, Brian. <laughs> I know somebody whose birthday is today, but oh, yeah? I don't talk to them anymore. <laughs> well, then fuck them. So... <laughs> <laughs> Not for any bad reasons. I mean, I feel like I'm going to say that every day. Like, I don't talk to that person anymore. Yeah, you just get old. Well, we don't, don't talk know. to anybody. Are, are you guys We old? don't have friends. Well, this is just a person that I met briefly. Okay. That's strange that you meet someone like briefly and you remember their birthday. An internet friend. You know, it was like in the MySpace days. Okay, okay. <laughs> I told you I have a weird knack for remembering people's birthdays. That's like the worst thing. Thank God for Facebook. Let me tell you, I would not remember pe people's birthdays oh, for yeah. shit. Well, I can only remember people who aren't important, their birthdays, you know? So like. I remember a lot of May birthdays because there's like one every well, that's fucking because there's day one for every two day. weeks. <laughs> that's like, when we get to the uh, May, holy shit. So many birthdays. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to take away from all the birthday boys and gals today. What? what tell us about some birthdays, Brian. All right, so um, I've got a, fa uh, a, a not a real person and a, and a real person. <laughs> you have person. a fake person. Great. I have a fake person on here. So it is Mickey Mouse's birthday. Mickey Mouse is a real person. How dare you? <laughs> Maybe in your heart. He is. First of all, he's like a gajillionaire. He owns two of the happiest places on Earth. Also, probably more in other countries. Also, I don't even, like, Star Wars and and Marvel. Star Wars and Marvel, and who knows what else they own? They haven't told us. They have. They're just you know. <laughs> they're keeping it a secret, just like Walt Disney's frozen corpse. <laughs> exactly. Oh, it's just his head. <laughs> oh, it's just his head. Yeah, yeah, not his whole corpse. That that's too much to take care of. Yeah. <sighs> Uh, so happy but, birthday, Mickey Mouse! Uh, oddly enough, when I was looking for this stuff, uh, Mickey Mouse's birthday wasn't in my list of birthdays of the day. It was in my National Day list. Really? Like when I was looking for National Day. National days. Mickey Mouse's birthday. Yeah, I was like, <laughs> I was like, it didn't even say that though. I was like, it's Mickey Mouse's birthday, and I was like, is this a national holiday? <laughs> <laughs> Not that I know of. But. So, but I, I was like, let's let's recategorize, guys. Recategorize, guys. <laughs> You I've forget, caught Brittany's not being able to talk. On today. the internet, Brian, yeah, your yeah. mistakes will be amplified. <laughs> um, it is also Owen Wilson's birthday. Wow. 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 I forgot how to do it. Oh, I got a Christian carp. Finally. <laughs> yes. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> now, sorry, I got some meow coupons. So, what's your favorite uh, Owen Wilson movie, Brittany? Um, I immediately wanted to be Shanghai Noon, but that movie's terrible. I so. knew you were going to say Shanghai Noon. <laughs> I was waiting for you to say that movie. I recently watched it, and it's terrible as an adult. But, gosh, I don't even know. I. He was the voice of one of the characters in. Fantastic Mr. Fox. Fantastic Mr. Fox is a great so, movie. I'm just gonna like lump him in there because that's such a great movie. Okay. So I'm gonna say Zoolander. Oh yeah, he was really oh, great in Zoolander. Zoolander. So you know, let's back it up and also say um the Life Aquatic with Steve's. Oh my suit? god. So pretty much all of the Wes Anderson films, me and Brittany are big fans of Wes Anderson because it Fucking is Fucking Marcel is in the lead with an eight point nine well, how big was yours? It was like seven, I want to say. Okay, so let's keep going. We got a few more minutes. Yeah, I'll keep trying. 
I'm sorry. You were about to talk about uh, Wes aquatic, Anderson. Or well, just Wes Anderson just in general. Wes Anderson. Yeah, you know, I love Wes Anderson. What's funny, though, is that I introduced Brittany to Wes Anderson with The Life Aquatic. And yeah, you, and I didn't get it at first. I was like, what is this? I thought it was supposed to be a comedy. And it is a comedy, but it's a very different type of humor that yeah. I wasn't used to at the time. And um, I was uncultured, I guess. And <laughs> I was like, I don't get this movie. And you always talked about how it was your favorite, one of your favorite movies. Yeah, and I was, it was just like, definitely... wow, I just don't get it. Um, but after, you know, so many years, I started to actually enjoy Wes Anderson films and understood, like, what it was about. And understood the dry humor of it. So that's definitely my favorite of the real life uh, Wes Anderson movies. Mm -hmm. Uh, but Fantastic Mr. Fox is just really hard yeah. to deny. I think Fantastic Mr. Fox is when I really started to appreciate his movies. And I really love the Royal Tenenbaums, too. See, that one I'm not a fan of yeah, at all. Yeah, I know all. you don't really like that one. But I recently rewatched uh, The Life Aquatic with Steve Zuzitsu, and it was really great, actually. Um, probably, I, I liked the Grand Budapest Hotel. That was really good. Yeah, I, I like that one, too, but it definitely wasn't my favorite. Uh, what was the other one that we watched recently with uh, the, like, Camp Kids? The Moonrise Kingdom. That was awesome. Yeah, that one was really awesome, That one too. was just batshit crazy. And then there's a new movie coming out in March. Yeah, the which Isle is, um... The Isle of the Dogs. Yeah, and that's another, uh... That's another, another animated one. Yeah, which so I'm, I'm really, really excited, excited about. excited about that one, too, so... Yeah, our big Wes Anderson, uh... Film people. The yellow perch. Nice. Sorry, I'm trying to talk and also You're pay fine. attention to fishing, so I might just stop in the middle of the sentence because my thought just swam away. Well, <laughs> ha <laughs> ha <laughs> well happy birthday, Owen Wilson. Happy birthday. Thank uh, you for watching our show, Owen Wilson. Thank you, Owen Please Wilson. like, I'm comment, and subscribe. All right, we're just going to have to add him now and just be like, thank you add for watching our show. On YouTube? At yeah. him. Oh. On Twitter. You. I thought, you meant, I thought you said add him. I'm like, yes. sure. Is that how YouTube works? <laughs> yes, that's exactly how. We're going to put him in the credits. <laughs> Thank you for being a friend. Travel down the road and back again. Your some, heart is some, true. Some, You're a friend and a confidant. confidant. Thank you for being a friend. <laughs> And we just burst into a song that had nothing to do with that <laughs> So So which is your favorite golden girl? And why is it um why is it uh, Betty Davis? <laughs> Betty Davis. I just messed that up. Betty White. <laughs> Betty White. I just messed it all up. <laughs> it's Betty Davis. A really old actress, like from like the fifties. <laughs> Definitely. She's like, so, Betty Davis is a guest character on The Golden Girls, so and she's just a skeleton in the chair. <laughs> <laughs> so you know how um, <laughs> the whole like Hollywood sexual harassment thing's been going on lately? Yeah. You know how we got tricked by the Tom Hanks one? Yeah. It's so, like he's been uh, a bunch of allegations about him being really nice. Mm -hmm. Someone did the same fucking thing with Betty White. Yeah. Uh, but it was like several people have uh, had sexual uh, allegations against Betty White. That was uh -huh. the actual like headline. Yeah. And it was all just like her not only like not apologizing for it, but outright like bragging for it. And it was like, I'm, just, I'm like 90 fucking years old. Who the fuck cares at this point? <laughs> What do you mean? Well, like, she was, um, it was a joke. It was a, uh... Um, oh, okay. I'm like, what? <laughs> no, she didn't really do that. I'm sad now, and she's not apologizing for it. <laughs> no, 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 no. It was a terrible You're spreading terrible joke. false information, Brian. No. But she was, um... They were just doing that thing where, uh, they did a lot of stuff from her SNL appearance where she was just, like, flipping stuff off and whatnot. Oh, okay, I see. It was... I'm really, like, the joke writer <laughs> did a much better job than me. I'm sorry. I'm destroying this joke. <laughs> you uh, got us all confused and heartbroken, Ryan. No, it's Betty White's still great. She's a sweetheart. Okay, good. But, uh... Her only crime is feeding that giant crocodile. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> Ugh. Ah. So, go, um, finally, we have... <laughs> The animal <laughs> birthday. More birthday. Oh, but, yeah, the animal birthday. So, uh, if you have the animal Tia, she's in your town. Tia. Um, she likes modern anything. Sweet. Modern anything. Well, like, you know, anything that would have the modern character, uh -huh. category. Uh -huh. you know, yeah, like I modern know. Modern furniture. I know. There's also a sweets furniture. She likes all anything from that. She likes piggy banks. 
Uh, a juicy apple clock, which I thought was ne- an interesting name of something. Yeah, I've seen that before. And star tights. So I just had a great idea. What's that? This is what we should do. We should go on to like a popular dating website that's free. Uh huh. And we should make a dating profile for each of these animals. Each, every single animal. <laughs> and put animal. in their <laughs> likes and be like, I love juicy clocks and star tights. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Tia. This is my birthday. Just, just put them in on Tinder. Yeah. <laughs> just make Animal Crossing. Swipe left, if, uh, swipe left if you want to fuck blathers. No. Yeah. Well, hey, look, you started this Not conversation. Blathers. <laughs> I don't know. I just thought it would be funny, like, because you were like, she likes modern anything. Mm-hmm. And mm-hmm. I was just thinking that would be hilarious if it was like, I don't know, a dating profile. Well, a lot of people on Tinder like to date squirrels, so I completely, I guess, you know. There you go again with your squirrel obsession. Is that what she is for real? Yes, he's a squirrel. Because every day I'm like, what's that animal? And you're like, I don't know, probably a squirrel. (laughs) So C is definitely a squirrel. Did you look it up beforehand? Uh Uh-huh. Okay. I think I feel like you're lying to me, though. I feel like you're just going to say that. (laughs) She's definitely a squirrel. (laughs) Wink, wink. No, no, she's a squirrel. (laughs) Okay. All right. I feel like you'd have to make a separate email for each animal. Oh, yeah, definitely, which would be, like, (laughs) the most annoying thing. No way. I can keep up with all those passwords. So how much time you got left for Christian Carps on that clock over there? You got a few minutes. Three minutes? Yeah. I got to go sell stuff, though. I don't have room. I only caught one Crucian carp. And I don't think you got this it one. It was small. Well, Marcel we... is the winner. All right, I'm well, that dog. <laughs> why don't why don't we go ahead and do the money rock stuff and take care of just regular stuff around town? Okay, and then I guess we'll watch the ceremony. Yep, yep. <laughs> and we can end with me stealing Marcel's trophy. There you go. We're just gonna beat him up. I will sell it. At least I'm making some money and doing donations. So I guess it's... Yeah, I mean, today is, was in a complete waste. Yeah, it's not a complete waste. But yeah, sorry, guys. We did not get that trophy. Hey, you're actually pretty close to uh, uh, like... 50,000 bells. Well, like you could actually pay off your house, I think. Um, Because you already put 50,000 into it earlier. Did I? Yeah, so I can't remember. you're about another 50,000 away. All right, oh well, man, he's got a flea well, on him. Well, too bad. He's gonna keep it on him. He could just have fleas. Old flea bag. <laughs> Old flea bag Marcel. Old flea bag Marcel. I'm looking for stuff to dig up and rocks to hit. All right. My shovel, trusty shovel face. Prince Charles, that's the name of my shovel. <laughs> Prince Charles is the, ooh. Whoa. Whoa, daddy. Almost, <laughs> come on. Bernie, why can't you aim? <laughs> I got excited. My God. I got excited. <laughs> Gosh, I'm so embarrassed, dude. I told everybody you I love. I told everybody I love catching bugs, and now here I am. Look at you. Lost the centipede. It's so the pressure. So you haven't played in years. It's the and internet show. It's, it's the pressuring internet show me. pressure. Yeah. It's, it's probably me going, "What the fuck, Brittany? What the fuck?" Yeah. Okay. Well, probably. That's, that's not. Fine. That's not gonna stop. Yeah, it's fine. I'll just. Get used to it and get stronger. There you go. And then come back and you'll never know what hit you. Holy shit. Uh, you know, I'm inspired. <laughs> oh, good. I'm going, you know what? I'm glad I'm here to make you stronger. What is, is that uh, a bug you haven't got yet? Oh, Pitfall. Oh, it's a grasshopper. That's my favorite game on Atari. Pitfall? Mm-hmm. I didn't know Pitfall was on Atari. Oh, yeah. It looks like shit. Great. Like most Atari games. Yeah, well, I mean, someone's gonna get me comments that like, "That's not my real, favorite think. console." No, it is. Oh, uh, no one who watches us is gonna be like that. And we <laughs> go retro, but we don't go that retro. <laughs> yeah, I played some Mean Pong though one time. Me and you played. Um, there it is. Me and you played um, ET not too long ago oh, at geez. Magfest. That was that really was the worst game ever. Um, I had no idea what to do with it, and I've seen people play it before. <laughs> I don't know. Me and you played Superman 64 as well, though. Oh, that one's pretty bad, too. I don't want to say so many bad games, but so many bad games. I could probably <laughs> do a marathon of really bad games. What, like, Ricky? What do you want? Okay. Uh-oh. A nicer, a nicer greeting. greeting? Okay, we got this. How about Bambiki? Bam. 
Sticky. Oh, let's let's make that two words. There you go. You want me to capitalize Vicky? Yeah, yeah, definitely. Ricky Bam Bicky. <laughs> That's great, Ryan. It really is. <laughs> so uh, I don't know why you like I just say the first thing that comes out of my mouth whenever these come up mm -hmm. and you have taken every single one of them. Yeah, it's fine with me. All right, whatever. I like them so far. I'll right. let you know if I hate it. All right, cool. As long as yeah, good. Yeah, that's always the one that because I am the on. mayor. You are the mayor. I am the I'm mayor, the vice mayor. mayor. I'm the bear mayor. Bear mayor. Bear mayor. Bear mayor. I like being the bear mare. Oh, we got another one. Okay. Okay. Hold on. Everyone be very quiet. Yeah! Yes! <laughs> Impede the centipede. Nice. Well, Blathers is just going to love that. Yeah, he's really going to enjoy that. Maybe this is the money rock. It is. Yeah, it is. Well, next time you get through like half the town without finding a money rock, let's try and do that thing where we show people how to like get every bag out of it. Oh, okay, yeah. Sorry, I forgot about that. I, I did too. I don't it's ever okay. do it. Um, but yeah, if we get like halfway through the town, let's try that again. Oops. Okay, sounds like a plan. You'll just have to remind me because I will forget. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'll remember next time we get through like halfway through the town without finding it. Okay, cool. Cool beans. All right, I'm still looking for the fake rock too. Yeah, yeah, it's still I around. I found it. Oh, find that fake rock. That's it right that's, there. No, that's a real rock. Did you already hit it? I guess so. All right. No, I just know that rock. I I'm still getting used to where the rocks are in this town. Yeah, there's a lot of rocks in this one. There's a uh, part of it's because we don't have any pathways yet. Yeah. So like once we get pathways, I'll start to like be able to memorize more areas. Once I get pathways, I kind of like, I, like in my old town, I don't know if I'll ever do that on this show, but I kind of had a routine, like I do the same thing every day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I don't yeah. think I'll do that on this show because that will be boring for people watching. Well, also like part of this, like... We got a show to do, people. Yeah. It's a big rock. Boop, boop, boop. All right, well, I guess that wraps up the rocks and stuff. So let's go watch the... Uh, the, the ceremony. The award ceremony. All right. And see how that goes. <laughs> See who won. I'm pretty sure I could just go in here. I, know, I might have to talk to Chip. Maybe. Yeah, you gotta, yeah, talk, I gotta to talk to Chip. Oh, wait. Oh, oh, here we go. Never mind. That also worked, so. Da, 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 da. Wow, you didn't even place. <laughs> no, that's what I was saying. Like, <laughs> my thing wasn't even. Wow, they were all really close. <laughs> yeah. Carlos! Carlos won third place. Third place finish. A bronze fish trophy. You know what? It's fine. I don't even care about that trophy because I didn't have any place to put it anyway. It's <laughs> true. I'll just be a sore loser. <laughs> I mean, it's fine, whatever. Peaches! Although I am genuinely happy for peaches because I really love peaches. <laughs> <laughs> Yay, good peaches! I'm your biggest fan! <laughs> oh, look how happy she is. Yeah. Yet still so far. Yeah. Wow, Chip. Oh, there we are. Oh, you piece of shit. <laughs> The goldfish trophy. I could go for some goldfish right now. Like the crackers. Mm. Not like the actual fish. <laughs> oh, I was thinking like uh, fried fish. fish. I could get some fish sticks. You don't. They're... Fish sticks are not made out of goldfish, Brian. <laughs> no, but I want some fish sticks. <laughs> well, we can go get some fish sticks if you want. Some fish sticks sound great right now. Okay, I could probably do that. We haven't done that in a long time. Since we were kids, five years old. Yep. <laughs> now it's just me. Just me and Chip. My loser self. Ah, crack knuckles. We're about to get busy in here. I'm leaving. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta. 
are about to kill us. Well, fever. guys, I hope you enjoyed the fishing tourney. <laughs> that wraps our wraps up our failure of a day. Um, <laughs> we got a lot done. Good news, the we are great. do have lots of money. Uh, we also donated a lot of stuff to the museum. Let's go ahead and pay off. Let's pay off some money. I, I was thinking about just paying some money on the bridge right here. Okay, well, if you that's how you number do one it. right here. Number two, I would love to have a bridge right here. All right. So let's just All right. pay a little bit on it. I'll cooperate. I'll cooperate. You want to do like 40000 maybe? That's whatever you want to do. Yeah, that seems like a good... That's right. I'm the mayor. I'm budgeting this You're budget money. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. Well, that wraps up day 18. Yep. Day November 18. 18th. I was about to say. I was like, wait a minute. This is not episode 18. <laughs> no. <laughs> it's episode... I don't know what episode it is, but it's, it's like November 18th, like that. so that, that's kind of messed up. We should start started November 1st. <laughs> well, then it wouldn't have started on... I know, but now hours. we're all messed up, and I can't count. I, I mean, need help. <laughs> in December, it would have got fucked up anyways. Anyways, know. you're right. You guys have a lovely day. <laughs> Sorry, I had a dumb moment. <laughs> Goodbye, everyone. Please don't... Ah, oh, the damn internet. They're always judging me. <laughs> Bye, guys. Good night.